Hey guys, it's David Long with Everyday Geek. We're at the Long Island Geek Convention, and we're here with Nina Tassant White. Yep. Uh, she was in Doctor Who, Casualty, EastEnders. So we're just going to ask you some quick questions. So Nina, first, um, how are you enjoying New York so far? So far, so good. I've seen a lot of hotel rooms, so I'm, I'm yet to explore Manhattan, and I've just been given some top advice um, about seeing lots of good sites. So yeah, yeah, it's good so far. It's New York, so can't be in bed. Yeah. Uh, so, really, I want to ask you first, one, you got your big break in 2007 uh -huh. with the show Casualty. Uh -huh. How did that um, open up everything to you as an actress? It's changed my life, really. It was one of my first audition, so I'm very proud of that. I came out of drum school, did the audition, got the job, and yeah, it's like acting's like baby steps, and if anyone wants to do it, it's hard, but it just got better and better and better. So, it opened a lot of doors, okay. I'd say. Yeah. So, and then you went on to EastEnders. Yep. How was that for, like, did that change the career a little bit more? I was quite proud moment because I'd watched it growing up as a kid like it's a, it's a big staple program back at home yeah it was amazing like walking around the square walking around all the, the, the things that I'd seen growing up as a kid and and yes it it it, it got me a larger fan base before the jobs that I'd done you know uh, weren't that big and then you kind of got recognized a bit more which is weird at 23 years old it, it was strange yeah. now I have a question we have um my daughter here, Lauren, one of the co-hosts of our show, she's always told me she wants to be an actress. Um, any tips for her to be an actress? Maybe not be so shy. Yeah. Number one, don't be too shy. Number two, you can't be luggage anymore. No? <laughs> no one, that's an inside joke. Um, and number three, never ever give up. Because you're absolutely beautiful and you can do it if you want it. High five? High five. Yes! All right. And then just real quick, I want to ask, I know you did an episode of Doctor Who, um, yeah. you were Mel's, on the episode Let's Kill Hitler. Hitler yeah. How did that um, change everything regarding the, the geekdom, like the, the geek world and everything? Uh, you know, it's, it's, it's strange. I was in one episode, mm -hmm. but the character, it seems she's massive. You know, she's got, her, her story's incredible. I'm still confused at what goes on, why she's who she is. But it's meant that I've traveled the world and, you know, I've done conventions in LA, Chicago. I've been invited to, Australia, but I couldn't do that because of another job. I, I, it's 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 strange because I'm going to be honest. I, d I don't watch it. <laughs> yeah, I, we, we just had a quick conversation. I know you don't watch. You weren't into the Avengers. You yeah. didn't know that too much. Um, but you just said X Men, so you're into X Men. I love X Men. Yeah. Well, I mean, the movies I've loved. I didn't watch read the. the okay. okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what favorite X Men? Who's your favorite X Men character? It would definitely be Mystique. Um, not that I'm evil, um, and I don't like people who are evil, but I just like what she looks like, I like what she can do. Yeah. She's hot! Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, and villains are cool, but no, we, we appreciate it. Thank you so much, Thank Nina. Thank you it was so great much. Thank, Thank you. you. Can I say bye? Bye. Bye. Oh, high, so five. high five. Wait. All right. Thank you again. Thank you, Thank you so much. <laughs> bye, guys. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's going to be shorter than that. <laughs>